The 2021 Desertification and Drought Day, held on June 17, focused on turning degraded land into healthy land. In an effort to restore ecosystem services and integrate the ecosystem management approach, the Department of Forestry, in collaboration with First Caribbean Bank, CIBC, held a tree planting event in Monsito. Assessments carried out by the Department of Forestry provided evidence of overutilization of resources for livelihoods in the area, which has the potential to result in a loss of resource base. The forest reserve was intentionally cleared for the production of charcoal and planting of agricultural crops. The activity saw the transplanting of approximately 300 trees with an eye toward combating deforestation. Country manager of First Caribbean Bank CIBC St. Lucia, Nigel Olivier, says that this initiative comes at a fitting time as the bank celebrates its 100th year of banking in the Caribbean. We wanted to have something that would be uh, significant and long-lasting and something that would contribute to keeping a greener space. And um, it, it sort of fitted well with the fact that we have branches throughout the, the region in all 16 territories. And as you know, the branch, a branch is also a part of a tree. And we thought that, um, you know, it, that would be a good thing to do. So we decided that um, let's do some tree planting. And so we've done that in all our territories and, um, you know, today here in St. Lucia. And quite frankly, I think we're probably going to be the best because I think we, we have, you know, a very special partnership in that today sort of fits in with what is happening as a country and then overall with what we're doing as a, as a bank. The event saw many other national agencies and NGOs coming together in solidarity for the cause. Acting Chief Forestry Officer Alwyn Donnelly says the tree planting campaign also aims to help raise environmental awareness and shed light on the importance of its protection. The activity here today would bring you know, all those stakeholders, all our partners, to actually come and plant the tree. So they would actually take the tree and place it in the soil. You know, it's not like we planting and they just come in and watch. No, they actually come in to plant. And, and that is also significant because, you know, that kind of activity can be replicated, could be done, you know, in other places. Um, they can come back in the next three to six months, you know, and see the progress, you know, of what their own, their own work, you know, their own labor, they could come back and, and see it. Um, and in that way, you know, when, you know, people are engaged, you know, in that way, in doing the, the practical work them, themselves, I mean, sometimes there's uh, greater um, value you know, that the place on the resources seat. Mr. Donnelly encourages the public to continue to adhere to regulations put in place by the Department of Forestry as the forest reserve and protected forest systems of the country are intended to perform essential functions such as safeguarding and regulating the island's water supply and preventing soil erosion and landslides. From the Communications Unit of the Ministry of Agriculture, I am Anisia Antoine